Hello, this is R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy. Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to speed up your Galaxy S6 Edge Plus. Now, this is some basic tricks, but it really does help to make your phone go faster. Very first thing you're gonna do is go into settings, scroll all the way up, and go to about device. Once you reach there, you're going to go to the status, and then, oops, nope, you're gonna go to software info, and then you're gonna to go to build number. You're gonna hit build number repeatedly. Once you finish with that, you're going to go back and you're going to see developer options are there. Once you're in developer options, do not touch anything unless you know what you're doing. The one thing you can turn on is USB debugging. This just makes it an external storage when you connect it to a computer. From here though, we're going to go into the drawing category and we're going to speed up these phones. So there's three things that say animation scale. You're gonna change each of these from 1X to 0 0.5. This tells your phone, hey, I know you can do things in one second, but you can actually do them in half a second. So this will speed up the overall movement of your phone. So when you go through it, when you hit home, it's just gonna move a lot faster. Second thing you wanna do is pinch to zoom and turn off flipboard briefing. No one uses it, it should never be on the phone to begin with, but it is. And then you can go back to the main screen. This makes your home screen movement a lot quicker and it's never delayed by that. The third thing you're gonna do is you're going to hit apps and you're going to get rid of all the unnecessary apps. So you can hit edit and you can uninstall any of the built-in apps that you will never use. Now these are built-in apps from Samsung, from Google, from your carrier possibly, and you can just remove any of them. So like for me, for instance, I will never use WhatsApp, so I'm just gonna delete that. And if it says disable, what this means is this will never run in the background. It's not gonna take up your cache, your memory, your RAM, nothing like that, and it will move quicker. Finally, as a last feature you can do, you can go to the smart, uh, let's, smart manager and any wrap apps that are consistently going through the background you can click manage apps and auto stop them or even uninstall them so these apps I just installed all my apps and all of these are running in the background it's telling me hey these continuously keep starting up so you can actually auto stop them so any apps that you don't need to stop like for this one I can just uninstall this one because I'll never use it this one too This one I might use for customer service, but I'll hit auto stop so it doesn't continuously run in the background. I don't need my bank continuously running in the background. I don't need Best Buy. And you can see how you can stop all these apps that run in the background for really no reason at all. So once you do this, your phone will be much, much faster and you will enjoy it. Hopefully you liked this video. If you did, please give a like, thumbs up down below. This has been R-I-C-K-Y, the Android guy.